The nickname for this place is the Garage Mahal because it's a convert. It looks, it feels like a converted garage. And so uh, the trail crews that get housed here every once in a while look at. That's that's what we call it. Its official name is the Thompson House. So it's tasty. Well, you know, I peeled these potatoes this morning before everybody woke up and uh, shredded the cabbage. And uh, last night I had to dig them out of the ground and wash them. Uh, planted them last year and uh, had a pretty good harvest. <laughs> of course, the tomatoes and lettuce came from my backyard as well. And, and food is very important. The fuel for your crew is key. You got to keep them well fed. That keeps them going. have all the safety equipment out there, hard hats, gloves, and glasses. Uh, if you have your own, you're welcome to bring them, but we'll have plenty out there. Rocky. <laughs> very nice, very nice. <laughs> They're new. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Take a new one. Oh, yeah. Can you come and see that on the side? This, this piece is what oh, actually okay. fits in there. Okay, I get it. We're hoping to develop this into a huge program that we travel all over the state with and work with all different volunteers from all over. We have three, three basic rules with the F Troop. The first rule is be safe. Have fun is rule number two. We want you guys to have a good time out here. And the third rule is, you know, let's get some work done. It has a bunch of numbers under required PPE. Now what PPE is, is personal protective equipment. And I'll go over what those items are in a moment. On the back, it's got what those codes mean, what those numbers mean. So for example, chopping tools. U.S. Forest Service approved hard hat, eye protection, gloves, non-skid boots. Okay, Greg, we just put these orange flags in. And do you remember now what these two orange flags here represent what's going to happen? They represent where the post hole diggers are going to dig and where the stringers mm -hmm. are going to go. The stringers are going to run between? Between 9 to 10 feet. Right, right. So that's what our project was and that's the first step for this boardwalk. And appreciate you coming out and your volunteer here. And Today we're out here in St. Mark's Wildlife uh, Refuge. And, uh, this is the F Troop Florida Trail Scenic Trail uh, workers here. There'll be a few people going out putting these flags ahead. I'm gonna go about nine feet. Has many people use the post hole digger? Well, it's great. You can't uh, ask for a better place to be January, February, March. <laughs> it's Florida. And uh, you're able to do this stuff uh, during the winter. It's just uh, too hot and too buggy in the summertime. It's, uh, it's good we have uh, local volunteers, uh, we have SCA crews, Student Conservation Association members, uh, AmeriCorps members come down from anywhere between uh, two weeks to three months. They come down and put their time in on a trail and they do a really good first class job. Well, I think for someone like me who's, who's not out in the woods every day, I just really enjoy getting out here and then working with the people here. There's a bunch of, a real good bunch of people to work with. So uh, I've been having a good time. This is my third day. It's a good family opportunity for uh, mother and father and the children to get together. A lot of times we don't have time to spend together with family. A good health exercise opportunity. Uh, so it's not forced labor, 
us so everybody's happy and they can do what they want on the trail as long as we're having uh, being safe, fun, and get that trail and boardwalk uh, put together for the Florida Trail Association. Yeah, it's fun working with the kids all ages, you know, all the way from, geez, uh, grade school, junior high, middle school, high school kids, the uh, college kids. Uh, you know, I'll be 60 next year when, uh, when I won't be able to be around here, maybe they'll be pushing me in a wheelchair. These young folks will be able to step in our footsteps and we train them and uh, hopefully they'll learn this uh, Florida Trail and help continue it and finish it. <laughs>